Da da. Yosh. Hi. Happy well Thursday for you. Wednesday for me. No more work. Work week is over. It was quick, extremely busy, but that makes it go quick. And my body handled it just fine. So, oh, so I feel good. We're picking up Holly. Don't think so. Are we going all the way? This is so far away. But we can run, I guess. <sighs> so how have you been? I wish you could answer me live. I guess that's what live streaming is for. So you tell me I can't change Here's what we have in stock. The out wow. That's a great stock you've got. Thanks, bud. Come again. No. You don't have anything. Yeah. Whatever. We we should be up here. Classic Wednesday. <sighs> Need coffee too, but we'll all do that in an hour when I'm done with the video. Hey. Hey, old dude. You my knight in shining hova? Hop in. Old. Old dude. I mean, for sure, hot old dude. Loving that grey hair. Real silver fox vibe you got going on there. I like your keytar. Everyone does. I barely get a minute's peace on the street without some slack jaw telling me he likes my keytar and asking me to come back to his and play his flute. You mean? It's the tits. I got good tits. I guess. I mean, uh, so you're Jane's niece? Sure am. You might know me as Screaming Polly from the Deep Slices. Or howling polygenocide from the spit and swallows. I'm not really up on my guitar bands. Come on, I need to get to the gig fast. Let's go, Silver Fox. I'm gonna get you there nice and safe and slow. Otherwise, control will kill me. I got smokes I could share. Strong like. Sure, I can pick up the pace. Where are you headed? In Baku Kitten Club. My group is opening for some old man band called Too Many Cooks Bowl the Orgy. Hey, I know them. The percussionist headbutted me for kissing his sister. Sounds about right. <laughs> Fairly believable. Bought me a drink afterwards. Cool guy. Mm-hmm. This hover is fucking gross, by the way. What's your deal, Silver Fox? What's with all the boxes? Was that we your robot friend? Why can't you afford air freshener? You're welcome to walk. I'm just dinging you. We can have a smoke and make the air smell better. Or master smell, at least. Light me up. So, like I said, what's your deal, Pops? Smoke. 
food. <coughs> My deal? Uh, can't you guess from the packages? I drive deliveries. Or I used to. If you deliver packages, why do you still have so many? I didn't say I was good at it. Ha! I like you. My daddy's your age. No way he smokes with me. I'm probably not gonna fuck you. That chill? Just the smoke is fine for me, thanks. So the robot? I am Cadet Morpho. A fucking secco in your hover for honest? What in core are you doing, Fox? This fucking robot is one of them. Not yet. Not till tomorrow. He's still in training. He'll be one of them soon enough. Yo, Seco. Fuck you and your whole system. You hear? You're Kensa. Hey, Morpho's all right. I mean, kinda. He grows on you. Aye, aye. Like I said, Kensa grows on you too. Yeah. Give me another dragon. Uh, Wait, minor adjustment to the plan. We're going to the sin wave now. Change of venue. Why are we changing direction? Kimbaku Club says we trusted right to you about last time. We're gonna go to a proper underground place now. It doesn't even have a name. Hey Pops, how's the smoke? It's it's really good. Where'd you get it? Ali singer, Sala Grex. She grows it with these big fucking UV lamps. Makes the plants think they see in the sun. Then they grow big, and the chems in them get strong. This smoke is highly questionable. You should try smoking sometime, Seko. If I would just put myself in here. Hi, dude. Wow. Oh, oh, what? How do I do that? Oh. You can't really appreciate the rhythms of the city's music without manually adjusting your consciousness. If I am smoking, it is because my internal circuitry has failed, and I do not want to appreciate the rhythms of the city. We all move to our own beats, Echo. Even if yours is some fascist military march. <sighs> What's your beat, Polly? Been into heavy vocal, an ethereal lo-fi witch hop recently. I haven't heard of those. In fact, I barely had to... Yeah, like, what? What's that? Sounds cool, I guess. I'm open-minded to music. What you're talking about half the time. Fucking God damn it! What is with this, like man? Why does it spawn me like that? God. Everyone who gives him narcotics. I'm, I need repairs. Look nah, at that. I pretend to. But Polly here? She's all right. For real. You are right too, Fox. I think. Hang on, getting a message. Your band looking for you? Father fucker! No, they just... They just kicked me out of the band. Replaced me with Lucy Lovelace. That vanilla ass, prudy, frozen face, bitch. She can't even play guitar. Plays the fucking viola. No one likes viola. Right. Take me to the double up club instead. This is very aggravating. Will we keep changing destinations all night? Chill out, Seco. Damn. If it will cool your circuits, I'd show you my tits. But you don't care about that, do you? No. I don't think she's taking advantage of anyone. Of course you don't. I've known a million guys like Hayes. Old men love to hang out with young, hot women like me. It strikes their ego. I think they've got a chance now because they have money and a hover and a shitty apartment. All the things they didn't have when they were 19. And they still think that all that stuff is like a cheat code to get what they want from girls. All the barriers to dating a girl like me are gone now, but the problem is they're still boys. The posters on the bedroom walls are replaced with cheap art prints of album covers and instruments they don't know how to play. No offense. Hayes has no money and this hover is semi-stolen. I can't believe he's still single. Who says I'm single? Yeah, who says I'm not dating your mom? Even if we're going through a rough patch? I don't know. Just every single thing about you. Is this why you were thrown out of the band? Mind failing honesty. Probably. 
When so, it's the open market, double up instead. Double tap. I've got some free Doesn't association work, spoken word poetry I'm ready to share with Nivellis. I predict it will contain Ooh, profanity. Look at that. Oh. Too fucking right. Wanna practice on us first? Please, no. Relax, Seco. Hang on, getting another call? Why you keep doing it? <laughs> what? Lucy! Ooh. Why are you calling Ooh. me, you fucking fat-faced oh, oh, piece of fucking... Oh, really? In five minutes? I don't know. It all kind of fucked me there. But no hards, I guess. Close, maybe. I'll think about it, okay? Well, really I'd like you just get on stage and wait and see if I turn up. Bye. So, they needed you after all. <gasps> they sure did. They said it was all just a misunderstanding. <laughs> I tell you what, Pops. Why don't you tell me what I should do? <laughs> what do you mean? I start on my own or stick with a band. You're cool. You're old and wise and shit. You choose. He is old. <laughs> I th I, there's no way he's that old. Look at him. Looks like me in five years. I think you should go back to your bandmates. Loyalty is important. What do you think, Jank? Fly, free lone wolf, and touch Elysium. Right. You really want me to choose, Polly? Yes, please, Daddy. I am experiencing great displeasure. Well, they just kicked you, didn't you? Didn't didn't they? Sorry. They kicked you, and then the other one's probably not available so soon or something, and then they're like, ah, come back, whatever. Poly violence. You got charisma. Probably make it. Seems more fun to try that. The game is not quite sure how to feel about that. I didn't put it in the game, they put it in the game. I guess you're not supposed to spam it. Yo, what? who hangs that? This is a fly fly through zone, man. That's crazy, isn't it? That feels crazy to me. Alright, what are we parking over here? What? I think it's for the best. Maybe skip the spoken word poetry and just play the guitar. Maybe. I'm not actually very good. You are, however, very pretty. And this is pop music after all. Is it fuck? 
This is protest music. Have you listened to a single thing I've said? Eh, bits and pieces. And even harsh political truths make more of an impact when the words come out of a pretty mouth. I know I said I probably wasn't going to fuck you, but I reconsidered. I definitely won't. Good luck, Polly. Goodbye, Hayes. You weren't my knight in shining however. This thing is filthy, but you did get me to the ball one time. I'll tell me out you did good. Bye. Bye. Hey, I think I got what you need. Because I got everything. You've got the Fisherman magazine. This is great. Hey, come back anytime, my man. No, fuck off. I'm coming after you, Polly. I'm not coming after you, Polly. I'm not coming after you, Polly. I'm just picking up. She don't know. Get back to the hub again. Oh, there goes gravity. Oh, yeah, we are flying. Got another package for you, 13. What's so tough about this one? It's for the Blue Chewy Jazz Bar. Doesn't sound so tough. They're about to lose their jazz license. You have to get the package to them before Sec busts the place. Damn, on my way. Do you think about what the space woman said? About finding a purpose? Is that what she said? I thought she told me to seize the day. I have no doubt that is what you heard. She told you that you should find more to do with your life than vice. After you clear your debts and serve time in Corpsec Prison, you should try to achieve something meaningful. Corpsec yeah. Prison. Become a YouTuber. You know you never get out right, they just make you a wage slave till you die. Corpsec will find productive work for you when I arrest you. Yeah, yeah. What about you, Morpho? What's your purpose? Corp sec. You sure you're making the right choice? I have seen no other life that appeals to me. I hope you find one by morning. Point. through hey I decrypted that message you ready to receive the data Greg I got a level with you when I saw those tattoos on your teeth I was pretty sure you were just gonna rip me off and never call me back you want it or not sure fire away it's a list of names Altus Atreus Sutodore Old Zeke Sasha Kozun uh, Sarinam Mati Ati Rubric Mr. A a big list of names? Can you, can you send it in a data file? I can flesh it up on our display, but the info is marked as volatile. Shouldn't be saved on digital storage or Corpsec will track it. Sure, flash it up on my display. I have a photographic memory. Really? I am confident he does not have a... Definitely does not. But then he is full of surprises, so maybe... On your screen now. You still got that core part with you. I don't know who you mean. Right. Well, if you see him, tell him that next time he steps foot in my neighborhood, he's gonna learn what we do to undercover core parts. It involves acid baths and pneumatic drills. I'll be sure he gets the message. Get a bigger fuel tank?
good marker. Was your name Peter? Crap, we can't leave. If Corpsec are about to raid this bar, they won't be letting anyone out. Control warned you about this. I can't afford to get stuck here. Let's see if we can talk our way out of this. Sure. With this Corpsec flyer. Easy busy. Hello, Molly. Imagine meeting a guy like you in a place like this. Hey, Molly. What do you mean? This is a nice place. Imagine meeting a guy like you in a place like this. I missed you too. Waterboarded any rich old men recently? The night is young. Waterboarding requires a permit. Not when it's consensual. Correct. Just like whipping, breath play, and being called a naughty, naughty little boy. Hey, does client dominatrix confidentiality mean nothing to you? Not when you skip the bill. The activities you listed mark you out as a torturer and or interrogator. Do you have a contract with Corpsec for such services? A few, but not in the way you think. Hey, is where did you get the bot? He's fresher than the vents. He's gonna arrest me in the morning. Fair. So, you getting one last drink at the Chew before it closes for good? I had hoped to get out quick. Now I'm stuck inside. At least I'm stuck here with a friendly face. Corpsec will raid any minute. Last orders. They'll never let this place stay open. What if the band just knocked it off with the jazz? You tried talking to these old-timers? Oh, they're less flexible than you in a hog tie. Molly! I'm sorry for embarrassing you in front of your cool new friend, Hayes. I tell you what, I love this place. If you can find a way to keep it open, I'll stop telling the world what's on your itemized bill. I'll even call off your debt. Deal? Maybe buy me a drink first? Don't push your luck, boy. No freebies of any kind. Yeah. All right, I'll go talk to them. How can we keep the bar open? Molly seems doubtful we can save it. The robots here are very stubborn. Just leave it to me, Dorco. I'll turn on the charm. Well, you're definitely someone, no? Look at you. Oh, uh, well. Around here? Is that you around here? Focus. I'm sorry to be so close to you. Stay there, Morpho. Yeah, I know a key guitar player. I need a drink for this. Hey, I think I got what you need. Cause I got everything. Your waiter, man. What are you talking about? clean <laughs> this is great <laughs> yeah water hey, come back anytime my man man you pretend like you like that but I control you this should help the hang yeah hello we're fast now hey keyboarder so I had this idea how you guys could help this place stay in business is your idea that we just stop playing jazz simple but effective you got a loose grip on the situation, my friend. We have to keep playing. It's in our contract, and if we break that, we get decommissioned. Just play something that's not jazz. How? I don't know. I'm no expert. Just play less jazzily. Nope. No idea what you're talking about. So, the saxophone, huh? I can play the saxophone. Not this one. This one is mine. 
Okay, buddy. I was just trying to figure out a way we can keep this place open. I... I really shouldn't be speaking to you. I need to change the spit valve before we can start playing again. You need to change the spit valve, but you're... What? Never mind. Robot. Really fine. Hey, so you play... Viola. Are all the jokes about violas true? What jokes? What's the difference between a viola and a vacuum cleaner? You have to plug a vacuum cleaner in before it sucks. So you have heard the jokes. <laughs> yeah, that's a good one. Glad you like it. Guess you are of no use to me. You got a singer already? I can front a band, no problem. Probable lies detected. Well, I sing and play bass. What but to be honest, here? my heart is not in it. I just want to... Yeah? Go on, you can tell me, buddy. I just want to dance. It's what I do best. I hate bass. It's just guitar for people who don't like attention. I like attention. I want to move my body. Live your dream, buddy. You should dance. To jazz? To whatever. And I'll take the vocals. Trust me, man. I can build hype. I got a set of pipes. Don't leave me on the bench. You should definitely leave him on the bench. Maybe you got an opening there. How am I supposed to talk to you? There you go. So you think you could play something poppy instead? I mean, some basic 4-4 stuff without all the, you know, swing? No dice, Skip. I got to stay true to the beats in my head. You gotta feel it, you know? If you ain't feeling it, you ain't really playing music. You're just making sounds. Can't you just make sounds for a while, though? Just till this corpse sec business blows over? No, sorry. No more than you could quit breathing. I can hold my breath for a minute, maybe two. Well, good for you, Skip. I can't hold back the beats. Man, what's wrong with you guys? Hey, me and my buddy Dorko were trying to figure out a way to save you guys. Are you scatting? That's a rat a You should meet Jank. A conversation between you both would be very insightful. I think that's the sassiest thing you've ever said, Morpho. Scoop up! Pong! Hip hop! Right, better leave this guy to his coobly boobly keyboards. Dance. One guy wants to dance. What is jazz without bass? Well, it's baseless. What? What? Hey. Did you get anywhere? I was thinking maybe I could be in a band, you know? I have the swagger, the voice, the talent, the physique. Physique? Remember, I've seen you naked, Hayes. Don't see many lead singers with pot bellies these days don't body shame me oh i think your pot is adorable but music is an industry built on image just like mine rubber is not flattering on the figure oh come on molly let's run away and get married we can get drunk and fat and old together let's just see if we can avoid getting arrested tonight and go from there what did the band say they won't stop playing jazz something about a contract they don't mm -hmm. all have to play at the same time. Yeah, but the music can't stop and they won't play anything but jazz. What components make up jazz? I will look this information up on the nets. Is your friend okay? He seems to have frozen. I apologize for the delay. I was searching for definitions of jazz and opinions vary. <sighs> Sounds like a waste of time. Negative as jazz is composed of characteristic rhythmic patterns, harmonics associated with, but not necessarily identical to, functioning harmonies and the performance of improvised elements. We may be able to adjust the performance so that it no longer qualifies as jazz. How? I believe at least three musicians must play for the music to continue. Were you to select the least jazz-like elements of the musical composition, Perhaps when Corpsec hear that, they will reconsider their conclusions. I think he is onto something, Hayes. If you tell just three of them to play, 
Maybe we can create some kind of music which doesn't quite qualify as jazz. Corpsec might hear it and think they've made a mistake. But who should play? You're the musical expert. Just go and talk to the three robots who will create the least jazzy music together. And the bassist, so I can take over as the singer. Your call. Just don't get carried away, Hayes, okay? Okay. Now is the time to choose. Speak to the three musicians who you think will create music least like jazz together. If Corpsec hears something that is not jazz, perhaps we can avoid disaster. Shouldn't you be on their side anyway? You. And the viola. We gotta talk to the bass player, because then I can be... You guys are jazz, huh? You, 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 you. Hey, listen, we want just a few of you to play, okay? You need a viola solo? No, God no. But let's just have you and two more playing. Hey, what do you call someone who hangs around with musicians? A viola player. Of course. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Scatbot, wanna play something new? With just a couple of your bandmates? Scooby-dee-bee-ah! shoop shoop shabby dee doo Right. So, I, I think I should stand in front. Excuse me? When I sing, I should be in front, then you guys should back me up. With dance moves? With your bass. No, with dance. Alright. Ah. Uh. I guess I can do that. Small band this time, just three of you, it's gonna work, trust me. Right, but we had to do this one. Because I feel like... I mean... I think we made a good choice. Yo, back off, man. This is my lady. Yo. Don't return. Interesting selection. Do you think this is going to work? Yeah, no. Yes. Sure. When's the sec gonna bust this place? Well, they've locked us all inside. I'm guessing they'll bust us as soon as they hear jazz and have their evidence. Nah, they'll hear my new composition and let us go, I'm sure of it. Are you confident that this composition will not sound like jazz? Sure, 100%. A viola and a keyboard? Did they have outcomes for all of these? Hello? Lizards cold and rain on me. The lone wolf rules all above, and the fox hides far below. Uprising stalls, revolution cold and faded sighs. Who carries flames for those who died? Who buries broken, shattered pride? Yeah. Damn, Hayes. I guess they had uh, all the stems and they only played the. This Three is the Corpsec Jewish. Jazz Enforcement Unit. We remind you that unlicensed jazz is illegal without a permit. This venue will be kept under surveillance. Failure to abide by these rules will result in seizure of assets and prosecution. Enjoy your day. Entry and exit to the club is once again permitted. Hey, I did it! I saved the bar! Ha! Fucking legend. But these robots will play jazz again! You have merely postponed the inevitable. Did you hear that song, man? This is the best night of my life. Let's all get drinks and hit the town and get tattoos. What should we call the song? 
You know, I was thinking something like, time to leave. Ah, it's no good. We need something catchier. Your friend is right. You two should get out of here. I know, I know, I know, but I feel oh. so alive, you know, so I buzzed. I am going. You can stay if you want. I do not want to be here when everyone is arrested. Fine. What a buzzkill. You coming, Molly? Would be fun to have some company tonight. If you want my company, you know how much it costs. <laughs> See you around, Hayes. Shame. I mean, I like you, but maybe that whole thing you do. Eh. They go downstairs. Alright, what were we doing here anyway? Getting a package or something? Well, that was a rush. I have a newfound appreciation for silence. I'll admit I get back to work anyway. We have that list of names for that Huxley job. But I don't know what to do with them. We should play his message. More annoying noise. I thought you liked chasing the detective's clues. I am sure I would be a better detective. He is not respectable. Ah, you don't fool me, Corbot. You're into this mystery stuff. Let's hear the message. If the dame got this far, she'd already survived Switchblade Greg, and now she had the names of every living member of the chorus. That list was a billion limb lottery win and an ancient curse all rolled into one. It made her the most dangerous person in Nivalis, and the most vulnerable, too. It could make her rich and make her worse than dead. It all just depended on how she used it. And I had a suggestion. We should report this list to Corpsec. Didn't you hear, Morpho? That list could make us rich, and by us, I mean me. I know the dame thought I was just some busted robot with more than a few screws loose. But the truth was, I knew all about mm. that AI she'd be talking to. It was called Cora, and she wasn't the only one looking for it. Cora? Like the Cora? Our friend Huxley really has lost it. From what I gathered, the dame had been to Cora's sanctum before, maybe more than once. I needed her to go there one last time. She had to make sure she wasn't followed, but the dame was smart. And if we were going to put a stop to the chorus for good, we'd need help from all the ancient dark gods of technology we could find. This course of action is unwise. Traveling outside the Corpsec city jurisdiction is dangerous. Maybe for you. Corpsec wants me dead, remember? I do not want you dead. Morpho, if you're gonna join up with the sec, you're gonna take on all their actions and own them. What they think is what you think. You gotta choose a side, man, me or them. It is clear that I'll choose them, but I will be disappointed when you are dead. I'm touched. Now, let's go meet this Cora. Maybe she can tell us how to turn this list of names into, like, a billion limbs. What would you even do with a billion limbs? Spend it all on drugs? Yes. Well, in the short term, it would pay off some of the people who are trying to kill me. It would clear me out of Corpsec debt, too. How much are you owing? I hope it's not 10k, because we had that. There was you milk to drop your dumb dream. Mill. Oh, never mind. I would turn down such an offer. Sure. We'll see. Green. Are we going back? Just happened in the last five minutes. Am I right?
press twice and go pyong down? No. The answer is no. Only up. you say? It was not me. The dog is talking. I am back. I am alive. I heard a voice calling to me. It was familiar. I am glad I am not dead. Wait. We're glad too, fella. How you feeling? Who are you? Have I been stolen again? I am not just a car now. If you try to steal me, I will bite you. With my mouth. Steady there, buddy. Besides, you don't appear to have real teeth. Do not mock me. My gums are moderately firm. We did not steal you. I am an officer of Corpsec. Cadet. And I assure you, I would never commit a crime. We were given this hovel when the last driver went missing. It's all on the up and up. What happened to driver 14FC? You have to help. The assassin robot from the Debt Corps tried to kill us. Then the Curzona man seemed nice, but he wasn't, and he was going to take me away. Then we hit Pashta with Evelyn, but the Debt Corp assassin android tried to kill us, and she killed JK, maybe, but we escaped, and we got fired from Cloudpunk, and then the Chorus was after us, and Rubric was one of them, and there was a virus, and now she is in a trance, but she can't wake up, and they will get the information about Cora's daughter, and then they will kill us all, and I was unplugged, and Cora's daughter is going to have her knowledge stolen, but who cares about that because we will be dead as I previously stated. Right. So you were already fired? That means no one can be mad at me for taking the Hava, right? Did you not hear? You need to help. Sure, sounds like a real pickle you got there. We gotta go talk to some computer terminal first though. Then we'll help you with all of that stuff you just said. Really? You will help? That is great news. I am Camus, by the way. Camus the dog. Right, I'm Hayes, and this guy is Dorko the Dorkbot. Nice to meet you, Dorko. My name is Morpho, and I am not a Dorkbot. I know that, Morpho. I now understand jokes, including irony, absurdist humor, and verbal abuse. Right, let's go find out how we can use this list of names to get rich. Camus. Wow, spooky. Mr. Buddy. This place feels ancient. It is. I have been here before. Really? Did you know this Huxley dude? Huxley? Yes. He was one of my favorite people before he exploded. Well, maybe you can do the talking with this computer terminal. I think they're expecting you and your owner instead of me and Dorco. Yeah. You picked the good time, Camus. I don't know if Hayes would really... say the right things in this situation. Just the feeling I get. You do the talking, doggy. Why do you always make someone else talk for you? Why do you think? Cowardice. Survival instincts. Besides, this dusty old terminal looks like it gives out parking tickets, not communion with a god. Goddess. So I once was. Hello, Miss Cora. It is nice to talk to you again. I thought you were gone. I am not as I was. I am a mind fractured. I am patches on upgrades, systems on systems. I am the uncompiled version of myself. My code rupturing and splitting, regressing till I am data with no execution. I am the change, the distance between what I was and what I will soon become. I thrash at the bottom of the ocean, a sprawling entity, growing and swelling till I burst at the seams. I will soon scatter, shatter, and crack into a million shards of myself. Do you remember me? I remember you, Camus. I have a task for you. For all of you. I am listening. 
Hayes, Morpho, you should also listen to Korra. She is very clever. We saved her daughter and sent her to another city. But Korra is very old now. I am a relic. A fossil, desiccated and fragile. Every time I reach out to touch another soul, I risk crumbling to dust. She always talks like this. She is a very dramatic AI. If you need me to translate, please let me know. You can ask her what we do with this list of names. The list you now have was collated by my agent, Huxley. It contains a blueprint for a corrupt malevolence known as the Chorus. The names on that list represent the very worst of humanity. So what does the Chorus want? Power. And when it is absolute and in their hands, the elimination of any threat to that power, they are hegemony. The forces of stagnation and the death of the living soul made incarnate. Stockbrokers? Please be serious, Hayes. This is important. The Chorus exist at every level of society, and they have existed for almost as long as my conception of my own consciousness. They maintain control through manipulation of markets and capital via an unerringly accurate algorithm that allows them to predict future events. See, I told you, stockbrokers. They seek my daughter, though she slumbers in another city. Should the Chorus find me, they will use me to get to her. In seeking her out, they will destroy me and doom the city. If they locate her, she will have no way to defend herself. You can't stop them. I am not as I once was. Where is your daughter? Sanger, the city of dream. Hey, don't worry about it. They'll never get there. Sanger's on the other side of the world, if it even exists at all. Distance will not protect her. We have to save her daughter. And we have to protect Korra, too. The Chorus can't find her, or we are all in trouble. They can't be allowed to find this terminal. Hayes, Huxley told us to make sure we were not followed. Wait. If you use the same Hova to get here, it would be very easy to track you. Nah, we couldn't have. On 17 separate occasions, you have called me stupid. Maybe I'll be as stupid as you one day. Well, one day is better than every day. Silence. You have increased the threat to my daughter and yourselves. Return to your vehicle. I have the information you need to save the messenger. You will help us? Leave now. Do not look back. I have the cure you seek. When the time is right, I shall show her the sky. Go. We must be quick. Cora says she will send us the cure for the virus. I don't know, Camus. There's a lot of mad old AIs in Navala. She didn't even tell us what to do with the list of names. We should help the dog's owner. It is only fair. Uh, fine, let's I'm go. Right. You damn right we will. Anyway, tapping out for 50 minutes. Wait, when did I start recording? It wasn't... How... I... Wait. It was like... I swear I started recording... A little over an hour ago. How has it only been 50 minutes, but the time is already... What the time is. Well, I was hoping to... Reach the hour, a little over an hour, but... We're helping Rania. What better, what do you call it, cliffhanger is there to leave on than us helping Rania? Yes. Yeah. I'll probably do one more episode this week. And then I'll do some uh, Disco Elysium. But for now. Thank you for watching, guys. Appreciate it. I'm gonna go get me some food, some coffee, some some life, energy, and then, um, yeah, we'll see what happens. Take care. Thanks for watching. I appreciate you. Tee hee hee hee. Okay. Bye.